And now it's time to catch one of the strongest legendary Pokemon to ever exist, Mewtwo. Mewtwo is actually easy to catch since he's not exclusive to any version at all. Now I say this, but remember, he shares the encounter pool with Raikou, Dialga, Reshiram, and Xerneas, all being exclusive to Ultra Sun, along with Entei and Zekrom being exclusive to Ultra Moon. The Swords of Justice are there as well for both versions. You're going to want to look out for green legendary wormholes at around like 4,000 to 4,500 light years deep. All you have to do after encountering Mewtwo is chuck balls at it, but remember he has recovered, so you're going to be there for a while. Remember to save and hold LR start before entering the battle with Mewtwo if you're looking to shiny hunt for him. I'm pretty sure you have to go look for like the green uh, wormholes, so like all you gotta do is find like a green legendary wormhole. And we should be fine. Let's go look for one because this is about to be like annoying because it, it, either it shows up or it doesn't. So it is what it is. Thank you so much. Oh my god, that took forever to actually find this man. All right, now it's time to actually see. It's time. It is time. It is time. Dog, this is what we've been waiting for, yo. This is what we've been waiting for, yo. Oh my goodness, it is time. Now it's really time to catch this thing. I've been waiting to catch this thing. Jesus Christ. I think it's like a rare encounter, too, because it was like... every. I, I promise you, the other legends are like not this hard to catch, but... I think it's always like the really like like legendary, like the triples, and like the guy himself. Oh my god, what is this? What is this music? Hold on, wait. Is this new music? Where's this from? Huh? So unlike the legendary birds, they don't have the Game Boy Color music. Is this from Heart Gold Soul Silver? I don't know. I haven't. The music is kind of nice for this man. Okay. What do I even do now is my question. Matter of fact, let me go ahead and do this. Let's go ahead, go into Rex really quick, because Rex can actually do what we need to do right now. Go for, like, two quick attacks. We should be able to just pretty much... Oh, yo, it's a remix! At least about 380 should be enough. At least about 380 should be enough. Just don't get unnecessary crits, please. That's looking like it's going to kill it, though. I don't know if I want to risk that. Don't want to risk that? I don't know who to risk. Um, well, I can start doing this. Hold on, wait. We can actually, this should last like five turns, and then we should be able to just go ahead and, okay, so the sand stream comes in. Five turns is all we need. Five turns is all we need. There we go. And now we pretty much just start chucking balls at this thing, because now this shouldn't kill. This should not kill. If it does kill, I gotta throw the bastard ball at it. I should just throw in ultra balls. This thing, let's go. What is that, a times three, I think? Oh, yeah, it's gonna be a minute. We're already at like three turns right now. Hopefully, this having him in like the red should help, I guess, a little bit. A little bit. If he can survive this next, like, hurrah, I don't know. I don't know. We might have to throw the master ball at him. Honestly, we might have to throw the Master Ball. We might have to throw the Master Ball. Hold on. That's not going to kill him. Okay, cool. Get in here one time. Come on, come on, come on. We got one more turn left. We got one more turn. One more turn. One more turn. All we need is one more turn. One. Oh, no. Okay. This might help. Nope. Okay. Never mind that. There's no way. I'll just throw the Master Ball at this thing right now. Because that's all we can do. Just throw the Master Ball at this thing. There you go. You can have it. What is it was really intended for, the Master Ball was supposed to capture Mewtwo to begin with. And here we are, back in Gen 1. There you go. We caught Mewtwo, everybody. Oh, my goodness. That was so annoying, too. That Because that was like, you probably had to, like, I had to reset every single time. It was not, it was just not easy. Like, it just wasn't easy at all. It just was not easy at all. But now that we have him now, let's go ahead and let's say no to the nickname, add it to the party. Let's go ahead, let me show the bottom screen right now. Let's go show that we caught him. Here he is right here, Mewtwo, 
the Mewtwo, the Mewtwo coming out. And there you go. That is literally how to catch Mewtwo in Pokemon Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon. Hopefully this was somewhat helpful for you guys. If so, hit the thumbs up, subscribe for more Pokemon content, and I will see you guys in the next Pokemon video. Bye!